look at this. Oh, it's beautiful. It's a dead body. Reboot. It's the freaking Terminator. Oh, it's him. Is it him? Him? Me? Diagnosis. Gunshot. Ethereum pump regulator. All systems in low power mode defective. Don't forget to check your eyes. Audio processor corrupt. Audio data damaged. Check your eyes. Yep, eyes. Confirmed. Dead. Wait, what is this one? Am I seeing double mouse clicks here? Okay. Optical unit. Impaired vision, corrupt mind, palace. Okay, what else is wrong with me besides the obvious? Left and right. I took my finger off the mouse. Replace legs? Right leg component, functional, compatible. Plug me in. Q to remove my own leg? Okay, wait. Q, hold it. Oh, double click? That's going to get me every time. Take it. Reverse it, probably. Plug it. Fetch compatible left leg. Jeez. Damaged. Incompatible. Get that leg out of here. Is that another android? Legs good. Self repairing freaking androids, man. That's how it all starts. Escape junkyard. So I can't scan anything. They're like half dead. They're still mother. There's a place where we can be free. Find Jericho. Find Jericho. Do we do we keep going toward him? You freak. I don't like it here. I can't see, man. W? W?
Find optical unit, find pump regulator, find audio processor. <laughs> okay, we can't see anything, so how do I know what I need to find? I guess this is one way, just touch everything. Incompatible. Oh, so much for that. What the hell? Incompatible? Can I take it from an already moving robot? Is that cannibalism? Thing I can touch. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. I'm grabbing her Chi Chi. I spared her. Was that the right decision? I'm going back in? Is this the same person? Thank you. Psych! <laughs> I almost took it again. They switched the buttons, I think. Clever game. Okay, he's dead. I will take his parts. Okay, I can't. They're all still alive! God dang it! Nope. Never mind. Can I take his parts? God dang it. Recycle, man! Can you please end it? End it. I don't want to live anymore. Make it quick. All right. You said it, kid. You chose this. Do we not salvage him for freaking parts? You gotta be kidding me. Did we just go in a circle? Is this the same girl? I think we have to kill her. They just keep turning me around and I'm losing my bearings on where the hell I'm at. I don't know if I'm headed back where I came from. Vita. Okay, incompatible. Head towards the Vita sign. Come on, give me something. At least so I can see. Wait, 
Where did where the frick did the sign go? What the hell? Something. Hello. Hello. I'm AK 700 Android. I was designed to serve you. What can I do for you? You can give me Hello. your eyes. I'm an AK 700 Android. My program has detected an anomaly. Please contact the nearest cyberlife maintenance center. Okay, that's a little better. Pump regulator audio <laughs> processor. Now we can scan though. Oh baby, that's clutch. Compatible audio processor? Yeah, 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 yeah. Found my next target. The hell? Go, go left. I mean right. Insertion. Floodgates. Uh, there's something there. Yeah, yeah. Okay. The arc reactor. Put it in your chest. Climb the slope. I mean, they don't look like they're making much progress, but I, I guess I'm the only one with legs. I'm not pushing the wrong key. I'm stuck on something. There we go. Oh, you gotta hold E. W? S. Oh, we're gonna pick up these quick times again. Q! Hold it. Correctly, get me out of here. Did they burn me. Is that my skin or my t shirt? I can't tell. signs check my mustache is gone T 
take it. Oh, we're gonna stab somebody? <laughs> Rip off? What am I ripping off? Oh, my, my thing? Scar? I have nothing there. How will they know I'm an android? My name is Marcus. Trick question. They won't. Just so happens I got a trench coat sitting there? Yo. I think we did the right thing not killing the other android. I feel in my heart. <laughs> it was the right choice. Find Amanda. No, look at this. Can we step in the... Sir, go back. Can we step in this? Oh, you lucky. I wanted to see my footsteps in the dirt. Can we go in the water? God dang it. Foiled at every turn. Maybe I can scan. Find Amanda. Is that Amanda? Would you like to go on the boat with me, Amanda? It's gotta be her. She's the only one here. Her and the, her and the pigeons. Oh. <laughs> I tried. Hello, Amanda. Hello, Amanda. Trusted. Connor, it's good to see you. Congratulations, Connor. Finding that deviant was far from easy. And the way you interrogated it was very clever. You've been remarkably efficient, Connor. Thank you, Amanda. We've asked the DPD to transfer it to us for further study. It may teach us something about what happened. The interrogation seemed... challenging. What did you think of the Deviant? Uh, intervention? I prevented it from being damaged, so we might still learn something by analyzing it. It said something to me. The truth is inside. I don't know what that means. Unless it was just another error in its program. This Lieutenant Anderson has been officially assigned to the Deviancy case. What do you make of him? He's a good chap. I think he's irritable and socially challenged. Clancy. But I also think he used to be a good detective. He's I an agree. intriguing character. Unfortunately. We have no choice but to work with him. What do you think is the best approach? Indifferent? Adapt. I will adapt to his personality. It is in the best interest no, of the she investigation hated that. that I avoid conflict and try to accommodate his psychology. More and more androids show signs of deviancy. There are millions in circulation. If they become unstable, the consequences will be disastrous. You're the most advanced prototype Cyberlife has ever created. If anyone can figure out what's happening, it's you. You can count on me, Amanda. Hurry, Connor. There's little time. 
Yo, look at her face. The faces are so damn real. <laughs> Give me your clothes and your motorcycle. Come with me if you want to live. It's my best impression. It's terrible. Don't cross the line. Line open. Hello. Hello, fellow citizen. I'm here to see Lieutenant Anderson. Do you have authorization? Yes. No. Do I? <laughs> Lieutenant Anderson hasn't arrived yet, but you can wait at his desk. Uh, find Lieutenant Anderson's desk. Can I scan faces? Oh, I'm finding crooks. Oh shit, I can't scan. I got excited. Sir? in the Arctic have reached a new level. A Russian carrier and an American patrol boat reported to have clashed last night. Sure. Several warning shots were exchanged, apparently with no damage or casualties to either side. The Minister for Defense, Dennis Riggs, there you go. has spoken of That's intolerable provocation that coffee? cannot go unanswered. The countries in the region, particularly Shouldn't Sweden and Canada, have called for military forces to withdraw and an international conference to be held. So far, there has been no response from either Moscow or Washington. We'll keep you informed minute by minute as the situation develops. Okay. Wow. Uh, can we go? Okay, yeah, we got clearance. How do we know whose desk is whose? Excuse me, sir. Can you point me in the direction? He's a lieutenant. Would he be amongst the peons? Captain Fowler. Q. Collins. Is that him? Who am I looking for? Anderson. Mr. Anderson. Excuse me. Do you know what time Lieutenant Anderson usually arrives? Depends on where he was the night before. If we're lucky, we'll see him before noon. Thanks. Okay, I'm not sure what that means. Explore new office. Okay, so <laughs> so much for for waiting. Listen, yo, what's he jamming? Mambo number five, I bet. Ding, ding, ding. Knights of Black Death. Heavy metal. All right. Fair enough. I'll make a phone call. We can order some pizza. How's my driving? Anti-Android slogans. We don't bleed the same color. Basketball. Detroit basketball cap. Cotton polyester. See the Detroit fan? Likes donuts? Cold coffee traces of caffeine. Clean your cup. Clean your cup, my dude. Japanese maple. Shishi Gashira. Canine hairs. He has a St. Bernard somewhere. He's a dog lover. All right, we're learning a lot about this man. Red Ice Task Force. Multi-department unit responsible for the Red Ice Network dismantle of 2008 or 28. A good... A good call? Calf? Real police. Does that say good? <laughs> Is that a G? Not 
something since 2000, not seen since 2019, owes me 50 bucks. Nice girl. A good, maybe it says good guy. I can't freaking tell. Real police? Huh. Wonder what that means. Matches. Jimmy's bar, wood, phosphorus. F. Research him. Detroit police dismantle a network of red ice dealers. More than 50 arrests throughout the country. Detroit's finest. Oh, well, that's him in the picture. Has dealt a massive blow to the city's growing red ice epidemic with the number of high profile dealers and suppliers now behind bars and narcotics seized with a street value of 500,000. Detective Hank Anderson, a young but hugely talented defect detective, is said to have been instrumental in the operation, which took months of planning. The DA described the work of Detective Anderson as his colleagues and his colleagues as model investigation work. Investigative police work. Uh, roll it. Yeah, there we go. Detective Anderson promoted to rank of lieutenant. Becoming the, becoming the youngest lieutenant on the D Detroit Police Force, Lieutenant Hank Anderson was among the most decorated detectives in DPD's recent history, securing a number of high-profile arrests and serving as an integral member of the force. Captain Fowler said that the pro promotion was long overdue, describing Anderson as among the most talented police I've ever worked with. The lieutenant is expected to rise quickly through the ranks of the department and is already being tipped as a future commissioner. New record seizure of red ice in Detroit. Nearly a ton of red ice discovered in the hood of the in the hold of a boat after a long investigation conducted by Lieutenant Anderson of the Detroit Police Force. Hmm. And that's after he's been promoted? Yeah, because it goes from 2028. Interesting. Hmm. Yeah, we learned a lot. It's good to see you again, Lieutenant. How's your oh, St. Bernard? Jesus. How about them Detroit? Hank! In my office. Team. Enter and listen? Are we supposed to go in here? He's going to kick me out, isn't he? Not you, bozo. I've got 10 new cases involving androids on my desk every day. We've always had isolated incidents. Old ladies losing their android maids and that kind of crap. But now, we're getting reports of assaults and even homicide like that guy last night. This isn't just Cyberlife's problem anymore. It's now a criminal investigation and we've got to deal with it before the shit hits the fan. I want you to investigate these cases and see if there's any link. Why me? Why do I got to be the one to deal with this shit? I am the least qualified cop in the country to handle this case. But I know jack shit about androids, Jeffrey. I can barely change the settings on my own phone. Everybody's overloaded. I think you're perfectly qualified for this type of investigation. Bullshit! The truth is, nobody wants to investigate these fucking androids, and you let me hold the bag. Cyberlife sent over this android to help with the investigation. It's a state-of-the-art prototype. It'll act as your partner. No fucking way. I don't need a partner, and certainly not this plastic prick. Hank, we were you are seriously friends. starting to piss me off. You are a police lieutenant. You are supposed to do what I say and shut your goddamn mouth. You know what my goddamn mouth has to say to you? Okay. Huh? Okay. I'll pretend like I didn't hear that, so I don't have to add any more pages to your disciplinary folder, because it already looks like a fucking novel. This conversation is over. Jeffrey, Jesus Christ, why are you doing this to me? You know how much I hate these fucking things. Why are you doing this to me? Listen, I've had just about enough of your bitch. Either you do your job or you hand in your badge. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got work to do. He stood up for us in the last uh, scenario, so I feel like it's weird to have. I would like to start reviewing the case files. That Can discussion you tell me where happened. I talk to Hank. Close the door on your way out. Like we made him Have a warm. Nice day, Captain. And now he's not warm anymore. Definitely savage. Go see the deviant. Check on Hank. Let's check Hank. 
pragmatic understanding constructive Finally. I get the impression my presence causes you some inconvenience lieutenant I'd like you to know I'm very sorry about that you don't give a shit partners no in any case I'd like you to know I'm very happy to be working with you I'm sure we'll make a great team come on Clancy desk I've been snooping around your desk and I noticed you like donuts in Detroit is there a desk anywhere I could use oh okay no good one's using that one right across from him he likes us he, he likes us he's just being a hard ass I hate you but feel free to sit across from me Just don't look at me. Dog? I like St. Bernard's, fellow dog lover. You have a dog, right? How do you know that? The dog hair's on your chair. Why would I say that? I like dogs. What's your dog's name? What's it to you? Sumo. I call him Sumo. We're going to make him love us. You're a Detroit Gears fan, right? Denton Carter scored 53% of his shots from the three-point line yesterday. Did you see the game? That's what I was watching at the bar last night. Oh. oh. How do we... How would we know that? I also love heavy metal. A lot of people don't appreciate having androids around. I that was, was wondering music is there any reason in particular you despise me i pushed number two was two not music yeah there is one uh-oh i didn't want to ask him that i wanted to ask him about his music now it's number one i don't think we need to bother him anymore if you have any files on deviants I'd like to take a look at them. Terminals on your desk. Knock yourself out. I don't like his attitude. Hank is not warm anymore. What if I give him donuts? Would you like a fresh donut, sir? Missing. Disappearance. Case assigned to Lieutenant Anderson. Is that a... Left his android at home as usual, went to work. When he returned, the android was nowhere. Okay, android's missing. Suspect. Is that part of the same thing? No. Attack. Involving android, yes. Plaintiff claims to have been attacked by an AV500. Fast coney dogs. Hot dog lover. Ah, yes. Plaintiff claims the android lunged at him unexpectedly and attempted to strangle the man before leaving the scene. The android remains at large. Involving android, yes. Attacked by her android. Disappearance. Scan all files? Yes. 243 files. Oh my First god. dates back nine months. It all started in Detroit and quickly spread across the country. An AX-400 is reported to have murdered a man last night. That could be a good starting point for our investigation. What do you say, Clancy? You shouldn't let your personal situation hamper the investigation, Lieutenant. You don't know what the hell you're talking about. So why don't you just run your program and shut the fuck up? Hey, take a look at these samples yet? That report says they cut it. I've been assigned this mission, <laughs> oh, Lieutenant. We're getting in his face. I didn't come here to wait until you feel like working. Oh no! Listen, asshole. If it was up to me, I'd throw the lot of you in a dumpster and set a match to it. 
So stop pissing me off. But things are gonna get nasty. He's already mad at Lieutenant? us. I'm He's got a history that we don't know about. Have some information on the AX 400 that killed the guy last night. It's been sighted in the Ravendale district. I'm on it. I feel like this whole thing has gone weird compared to last scenario where he actually pulled the gun on a human to prevent him from shooting us and now all of a sudden he hates us again. Like, I don't want to work with that thing, but I'll save his life. I'll pull a gun on a human. Seems a little weird. 